Hey guys, happy Monday and um, forgive the no makeup look today. I promise I will get cute the next time I do one of these videos. But I wanted to give you guys a quick tip on getting more out of more of what you want out of life, um, especially when it comes to relationships, but really just anything, your finances, your health, all of that. So for those of you who are into law of attraction, you've heard um, what you focus on magnifies and if you're also a biblical babe like me, I am a little bit biblical, a little bit woo, so I like to miss those two. Um, you've heard Proverbs, as a man thinketh, so is he. Uh, Job, you know, what a man decrees that will be established. And, you know, we hear those a lot, especially when we talk about money, um, about attracting more money into our lives, but it works for our relationships too. Like, the relationships that you're focusing on, the things that you lack. Um, you focus on being lonely, so therefore you bring more of that into your life. So as we start this work week, what if you were to take the time to flip that a little bit? Focus on the people in your life who care about you. Um, focus on the love that you already have. And once you do that, you'd be amazed. You will start attracting more and more love into your life. Focus on the love that you have for yourself. Guys, I kind of find it hilarious that you may have noticed on my social media, I use the hashtag the cherished woman these days. And since I've started using that, it is funny how many comments I've gotten from friends and family and from people who follow me on social media about how much they appreciate me. Um, I have inadvertently called in being more cherished than I already was. Um, when you are around people who are negative you attract more of that negativity in your life so why don't you spend more time with some of the more positive people that you know those people who always seem to light up a room you know who i'm talking about those people who are always there with a quick word of encouragement you spend your time with those people and you will be amazed at how much more positivity you call into your life in terms of having better relationships in terms of having more money in terms of more wellness in general. So just a, again, a quick tip for this Monday morning to focus on the positive, to focus on the love that you already have, to focus on the family and friends that you already have, the great relationships that you already have. Once you start doing that, you will attract people who will also show you more love and care the same way those people that you already have in your life do. Once you start to focus on the positive role models in your life, the people who have great relationships, you will attract great relationships into your life. Um, great friendships, great relationships with a partner, um, great relationships at your job even. It is amazing how much it works that it's just these tiny little shifts in thinking every day that add up to make a big difference. So again, as we start the work week, I don't expect you to <laughs> completely change your mindset in one day. Nobody does that. But just today, take five minutes. And if you are single and you're looking for a great partner, think about a married couple that you know, that you actually know, not just someone who puts up a front on social media, a couple that you know that you admire their relationship. You admire the way that he treats her and that she treats him. And focus on that for a few minutes and call into some of those feelings and some of the things that you want in your own relationship. Um, if you're trying to uh, attract more assertiveness into your life, then think about a woman in your life who exhibits that and add in that attitude for, for a minute or two. Think about the things that she would do and say and the way that she would carry herself. Again, just five minutes today, five minutes tomorrow and you will be amazed at the shifts that will come in your life. So I hope this is helpful. I will talk to you guys later. And again, I promise to be cuter in the next live video. Um, bye guys.